You have entered the Chronics rabbit hole. And Erica, thank you so much for your Patreon membership request and for bringing something new down the rabbit hole. The name of this band is called Heavy Saurus. And the song title is Heavy Metalli Sarvit. Interesting. Thank you so much, Erica, for bringing this down the rabbit hole. Erica, thank you so much for giving us a little context with the write-up here, because as you can tell, Alana has no idea what we're doing. I actually got to check it out before, so I'm very excited for this one. But so everyone else knows, this is what you have in your write-up. Here we go! This month, I'm bringing you something child-friendly. Okay. Heavy Soros was formed in 2009 with the idea to make heavier music for children. And of course, their metalhead parents get to enjoy it too. The band members are four dinosaurs and a dragon. They have won two Emma Awards in Finland for best children's album. Oh cool. my god, Finland's the best. This concept has been so well received that now there are heavy Soros bands in other countries too. Heavy Soros. Like this it. is so cool. This song is called Heavy Metal Servant, Heavy Metal Horns. I like this video because you get to see the audience too. Cool. Awesome. And another tidbit here. And I believe they actually play live in the costumes. Fun fact for you about Finland. Finland has the highest concentration of heavy metal bands in the world. That's 70.6 metal bands per 100,000 inhabitants. Wow. This is closely. What? This is closely followed by Sweden with 45.5 metal bands per 100,000 inhabitants. That's insane. That's a huge gap. I can't imagine what Canada is. There's heavy source bands. Life's great. Life's great. All of us going to love metal. this one. <laughs> yes, he will. Thanks, Erica. Thank you. Erica, thank you so much for bringing heavy source a metal children's friendly band so cool. down the rabbit hole i can't wait to get into this we actually as you all know ollie loves metal even today on the way home from the zoo he passed out listening to dream theater so i can't wait to get into heavy saurus and heavy metal heavy metal heavy metal horn Woo! for this live video and where we get to see some of the um the people there? The just... people as well. The crowd. <laughs> the crowd. That's the word I was looking for. So if you guys are as excited to be here with us as we are, remember to like this video. Comment down below something you would like us to know about the heavy metal Saurus or other heavy metal Saurus or kids metal bands that you know of. And subscribe if you so you never miss a video coming down the rabbit hole. Put out your heavy metal horns, y'all. Okay, right on. Oh my god. Oh. Oh my actual. Oh my god, this is awesome. Is he doing candy? Oh, nice. This is so brilliant. Okay, okay, let's let's bring this back for a second. Oh my, oh my god, I need to actually pause it right on the basses here. Okay. Got a nice five string basses here. He is just laying it, and I think this is just perfect. If you're thinking of what can last forever, you have 
keeping the parents happy with the good music. You have the dinosaurs. You actually have the costumes live. They're actually good. And it's fun. You won. You won. You did it. You literally did everything that anyone's ever wanted with ki with kids music because the amount of times even for us listening to kids music where it's like please turn it off my brain's turning to mush I'm going I'm I'm going to die like literally and so this is like the perfect way to keep kids engaged keep the parents happy Yeah and I'll go to this concert. I go to this concert. Look how much fun all those kids are having too. They're yeah. like, "Oh my god, yeah!" And you, they're talented. So like, I can't wait. If they got talented. like a solo coming here or whatever. Like, they kind of are giving me because of the costumes. It's kind of giving me like um, the dinosaur movie um, when we were kids with like the duckbill dinosaurs and everything. I don't know. Oh my goodness, name. I can't even remember the name of it now. But like, if all those dinosaurs became like with you know Bigfoot, Longneck. Oh, yeah. Land Before Time? Land Before Time! It's oh. giving me Land Before Time, but as a metal band. Okay, so <laughs> all the friends together. Here all the go. friends together. There we go. Nostalgia. <laughs> yes. Oh my god. <laughs> that guitarist. Oh, I love their merch too. Action figures? Yeah, imagine these merch. Here we go. They got a solo too! That's so great, because that's the official live video, right? Yeah. And what I have to say about knowing how official videos like that are actually such a grind, you're going to have to have all those kids jamming and performing the whole time and so many cuts. Uh, those That's a long day for those that's kids to be there day. performing like that. So they brought the energy the whole time, one. But, like, two... They even had a solo, y'all, and it was great. It was a good solo. It was a good solo. Like, it's really, like, yeah. this isn't a gimmick. And, like, you can tell right off the bat if it, something's going to be gimmick and if it can last or not. This has been Absolutely. since 2009, right? And so, they're like, still going. And they're still going. And they've influenced other country, other heavy yeah. stars bands in other countries. <laughs> and so I love, like... I love that you really brought up gimmicky because um, often when we hear about, you know, bands trying to make kids music or make something that ki adults can, you know, enjoy, enjoy as, well. as well as the kids enjoy it, often it does become gimmicky or it's only, it's too very short-lived or it's too forced yeah. in a way. Whereas this isn't forced. This is like, you and I make up a lot of like random metal songs as parents in the car yes, and do. do a lot of random things. These are people who probably have kids or nephews or things like that who are extremely talented who took this idea of like, hey, we could actually make something happen of this and it would be insane. Yeah, it would be beautiful. Totally. And they actually went with it. They put their their soul was on fire and they just followed their dream and they made something that is like. Honestly, the best thing that you can even take a kid to as well, because now their kids are being influenced to play instruments. They're being influenced yeah, in the right direction. Yeah, to push the limit too, right? To push the and limit. And to throw the creativity with it. You can still Absolutely. have your costumes and still play well. Absolutely, right? you can. Yeah. And um, I love that there was, like, I was watching a lot of the crowd and what was happening because, like, out here, if we're, like, wanting to do something with the kids, you know, you got Chuck E. Cheese or you got, like... 
um, different arcades and things like that. But they got action figure merch. They've got balloons that they're throwing around yeah, instead of crowd diving. Yeah, or anything. exactly. They're throwing balloons around and yeah. hitting them at each other. The Very band correct. threw candy into the. Um, it looked like those candy too. Yeah, right? it looked yeah, like yeah. a handful of candy just got tossed, oh and the kids were super <laughs> excited. You know, the kids are dancing, so it's not like a mosh pit, but there was enough room for them to be moving and yeah. dancing and getting right up with the with the band so like this is a correct way to introduce children into concerts introduce children into good music without it being forced or gimmicky in all the best ways i agree and as parents now together mm -hmm. i think that also helps me because you've been a parent before i was but like seeing this now is like oh yeah like now that i'm listening to all the child music from canada like we don't have metal hits like i bet we're like yeah. one metal band per a hundred thousand where you guys were at like 70 <laughs> and like i can really respect the metal parents from finland and europe itself that needs a band Absolutely. like this just to stay sane and i just can't imagine it encourages me to actually bring oliver to just concerts in general absolutely and knowing right? that that's actually something that is done in other places like yeah. finland yeah. where kids are going to concerts and stuff where they can handle here, it concerts are reserved for often most of the concerts out here 18 plus you can't get yeah. into them until you're 18 so like this is really cool to see that there's something for kids that's good that's talented and that's going to be um promoting kids and inspiring them in the right direction yeah so thank you so much erica this really lightened our day so thank you for giving us a smile as well as enjoying some incredible music so heavy source never thought i'd hear it but we saw it here first so thank you so much if you want to see more heavy source come down the rabbit hole let us know in the comments below and like this video have a good time go to heavy source if you want to see more of them as well to support but we are now exiting the rabbit hole folks thank you so much erica peace and love everyone god bless y'all take care and bye for now don't forget to like comment and subscribe for more enter the chronicness special thanks to all of our youtube patreon and buy me a coffee members thank you for all of your support Thank you so much for making it all the way to the very end of the video. And if you have not yet done this, here's an easy way to subscribe to our channel. And if you want to subscribe to the artists that you just heard, here's an easy way to do that as well. And if you are also interested in finding a video that you might like, just click here. Thank you so much for coming to the channel. Peace and love, everyone. God bless y'all. Take care. Bye for now.